what will happen to Serena's baby? More importantly, who's the father? Is it Fred? Is it Mark Twello? Perhaps none of these two. Thankfully, the creator of the series decided to reveal the identity of this man, and we do know that it's not Mark Twello. Just a fair warning, this video contains spoilers for Season 4 of The Handmaid's Tale. After what seemed like an eternity, viewers finally saw some progress in the series. The show left us with a shocking and, more importantly, very satisfying finale. One of the most frequently asked questions after we saw the finale is, what will happen to our dear protagonist in the next installment? But viewers are also curious about Serena Joy's future. Will she become a handmaid? Is the architect of Gilead finally facing her own karma? Fans of the series have been coming up with different theories regarding the antagonist's future, and one of the most famous ones is linked to her baby. More precisely, a lot of fans believe that her baby's father is Mark Twello. This is a reliable theory, a theory that is supported by many, many storylines. First of all, Serena Joy Waterford, a character played by the amazingly talented and beautiful Yvonne Serhovsky, and Mark Twello, a character played by Sam Yeager, have a lot of chemistry. Fans were convinced that there's something more between them ever since the second season of the series premiered. But once viewers saw the finale of the fourth installment, they became 100% sure that Fred Waterford, a character played by Joseph Fiennes, is not the father. As previously said, the creator of the series decided to address these theories, and we were pretty surprised by his answer to the question of whether his wife's baby is Mark's. In an interview with Entertainment Weekly, showrunner Bruce Miller noted that Mark is not the father of her child. But why were so many fans convinced that he's the father of her baby? Well, you might have thought about that when you served the warrant. You arrested me. Now you've got well, Fred's wife and Mark had a suspicious conversation in the season 4 finale of the series. This conversation only fueled the theories of the pair having an affair. Just to be clear, they either have, had, or are still having an affair. We're not sure. In the episode titled The Wilderness, Fred does anything in his power in order to get the free out of jail card. While he reveals some secrets about Gilead, his wife is seen talking with Mark. She tells him, We're gonna need a home that's big enough for our family. Of course, security is a concern, so once the commander returns from Europe, I'd like to schedule some tours. You're both still under custody until the judge's ruling is issued, Mark replies. The judge's ruling needs to be expedited, she says. The commander and I have discussed it. We'll not have our son born in this place. The following lines are when the conversation became something more than a professional relationship. Mark asks Serena, you plan on leaving with the commander? As husband and wife? She answers, as a family, of course. Can you explain that to me, Serena? Mark asks. And it's not what he asks, it's more the way he asks her. It's like she owns him an explanation after what she did to Fred. He asks her, as if he has developed feelings for her, don't you guys agree? I don't believe I have to, Serena answers. But who's the father? You plan on living with the commander. As husband and wife. How come Mark is not the father of the baby? Damn, like, we really, really believed he was the one. But as already mentioned, Bruce Miller confirmed that he's not. I think it's reading too much into it, it's reading into the chemistry. His job is to make her very, very comfortable with him, and he does it very well. But I don't know how much is the job and how much is the way that he feels about her. But I don't know that he even knows. This is his job to make her comfortable and to trust him. He told Entertainment Weekly, adding that they have a very interesting, complicated relationship, and because he's an intelligence officer, his job was to kind of become obsessed with her, before he met her, and know everything about the way that her mind works. You can't help but be impressed by someone like Serena in that way. So, is she impressive to him? Sure. But Fred is the father. Now that we know that Fred is the father of his wife's child, we can't help but wonder about her reaction to his death. What will she try to do next? Now that she knows her husband died, and she probably knows that it was June who killed him. What will be her next move? Well, Mark believes that she's really, really dangerous. Before viewers were able to hear the previously mentioned conversation between Mark and Serena, Jaeger did an interview with TV Insider. In the interview, he practically denied the theory of his character being the father of Joy's baby and said that you need to smash that like button if you haven't done it already. He knows how powerful Serena is, he wants to hold on to her as an ally for as long as he can. This is a complicated allegiance, the actor said, adding that Serena is becoming more dangerous to Mark with each episode. Thankfully, we know more about her future in the series thanks to these first look photos. I'm going to get Fred to drop the claim. 
Serena doesn't look happy in the next installment of the series. Digital Spy gave a first look photo of the character, and if we're certain of one thing, is that the character is not ahead of a bright future. Neither is she nor her baby. Here is Yvonne Serhovsky back in character, and it's super clear that she has already found that her husband is dead. For those of you who need a reminder, June had the opportunity to punish Fred for everything he has done to her. With the help of other former handmaids, she killed the most despised villain in the series, and she sent his finger to his beloved wife in Canada. In the first look picture, we're seeing his wife holding what appears to be her newborn baby, while also holding up her hand in front of a car. Shortly after the premiere of season 4, Strahovski told TV Line that her character knows June did it. There's no need for proof. The Handmaid's Tale will air new episodes on Wednesday, September 14th on Hulu in the US. There are a lot of things fans want to see in the next season, from the collapse of Gilead to June being reunited with her daughters. Anyway, one of the most awaited storylines that would make a lot of fans happy is if Serena loses her baby. Frequented a brothel. We we'll want to check for STDs. We'll draw some blood and get a genital swab. Fred's death is perhaps one of the most influential things that ever happened in the series. His death will have an influence on the protagonists, and of course, it'll have a major influence on his wife. But it appears as if this situation is perfect for his wife. She can use his actions to convince people that she is the innocent one. But then again, June sent her a package, a package with Fred's finger in it. And if we know one thing for sure is that Serena hates losing. This only confirms that the two are ahead of a big war. A lot of fans believe it would be perfect if she actually loses her baby somehow. This doesn't mean that the baby will die. Serena might get her karma with her baby being taken away from her. Don't you guys think this would be the ideal conclusion for the character? This only brings us to the question of whether this is the last season. With more and more TV shows being cancelled, we can't help but wonder if the end of The Handmaid's Tale is near. Speaking at a Television Critics Association panel in February, Miller said that he's not really thinking of ending the series soon. Deadline reported, As long as Lizzie will do this with me, I'll keep going. He said, adding that there's a lot of life in this story. He also talked about The Testaments, Hulu's adaptation of Margaret Atwood's Handmaid sequel, saying that he's certainly fascinated by what happens in The Testaments, and if that's going to be part of their future. That's a bigger question. He also said that you need to smash that subscribe button and notification bell so you'll never miss any of our videos in the future. As for June's uncertain future, we know for sure that she's not finished yet. Moss told The Hollywood Reporter that her character wants to bring the whole system down, and with what would come saving Hannah, her daughter, saving Janine, her fellow handmaid, and the proper revenge on Serena. See you in the next video.